Hey, what's up everybody? Arboots Games here, and today I got a little strategy for a high round on Zombie Map Die Rise. So, I haven't actually been doing this the whole time. You might be able to tell by the amount of points that I have. Almost 150,000. But, I'm just gonna quick uh, get most of the zombies in the map, if not all of them. It shouldn't take too long, but you never know. So basically, I'm in uh, this uh, Chinese looking place upside down. Let's see, to get here, I might have to show you how to get here later. Maybe at the end of the video, I'll oh, have a quick clip of how to get here. But basically, I've got all six perks. I have the Galvan Knuckles, um, and I've been using those to kill the, I don't know what you'd call them, the dog round replacements, I guess I'd call them. And if you use melee weapons only, then you get a free perk at the end of the round. So I did that to get all these six perks. So I've got three weapons, the Pack-a-Punched PDW, Pack-a-Punched AN-94, and the Slick Will Fly, Slick Will Flyer. Sli can you say that slick with fire <laughs> so this is basically the only weapon you need I mean these are good for getting points obviously but what I do to kill them if you okay, that <sighs> okay take two okay uh, after that little uh, mishap I'm trying right now I'm just trying to kill all the slow zombies so I can do it to a whole round or a whole horde of zombies. So a few more will spawn in after I killed those. So let's get my Sliquifier back out. Hopefully not screw this up. And I think that there's always gonna be like slow zombies. Like I think they're always just gonna get replaced. But whatever, what you gotta do is you run up here, wait for the zombies a little, and when they jump off, they'll all like be in the same exact place. Then just shoot the Sliquifier once, and it should kill them all. It might leave a few, and those are usually like the slower zombies, but this is, this is what I did for last round, and I think the round before that. So, very simple. The setup. I guess the setup to get all this stuff isn't exactly the easiest in the world, but once you have everything, and you really don't need uh, six perks, like the main one you might want is Sleight of Hand and Juggernaug. You don't need three weapons, because I've been using mostly one weapon to get all these points, and that's just this PDW. So, uh, oh wait, that's right. I gotta add the clip at the end of how to get here. You know what? I'm gonna take a risk since I'm getting a little sick of doing this. I'm gonna try to do it mid-round. Alright, so here we are at spawn. Clearly what my plan, original plan was going to be didn't work. So I'm pretty sure, wow, I missed. I'm pretty sure you only need 1500 points at a minimum just for the doors but you open up the first door drop down here PDW is right there and then you can either drop down here or if you buy the escalators you can drop down there or actually yeah you just drop down there and then you jump from here and you can jump down here but watch out because when you fall from a high height you tend to slide a little and you can just easily slide right off the edge down into the abyss. Then you run over here. I don't know why that power switch is there because the power is a long ways away. You jump down. Galvan Knuckles are right here. Help you to kill the, uh, the monsters. Then you slide down there. Then nothing. Then you jump down here. Then pretty much go crazy and then here's the AN-94 for 1200 and this is the final barrier 
So, all you have to do is just run around here and get to high rounds. Well, I guess you have to turn on power and do all the other stuff. The only downside to this, and this is mainly to using uh, the AN94, there's no, well, there's no easy way back up here. If you, uh, yes, that was an accent. If you uh, get the trample steam, you can actually put it on uh, that pillar, that broken down pillar, and like launch yourself up there. But if you don't have that belt, then the only way to get back over there is to do a loop around the whole map, and that will take a very long time. So, I hope you like this. I hope this will help you get to high rounds if you like doing that type of stuff. And if you haven't subscribed already, please do, and I will see you later. Bye.